What an incredible build to log into, eh? This is a uh, pretty crazy logging in on top of this thing. Now, for those that don't know, of course, a big group of hermits, myself, and a couple of guests all headed out to Michigan recently uh, at the beginning of April to raise money for Gamers Outreach like we did last year. But this time we were in person at the Gamers Forgiving LAN event that they put on every year. And uh, well, we kept it as a surprise for you guys. And part of it was to add signs to this. Now, everybody that has a yellow sign, I believe, donated, I think, it was, I want to say $200. And then everybody that was on one of these signs donated $50 which was amazing. And so I think there's even a sign at the very tippity top of this whole build. We only did this for like a few hours, by the way. It was like a limited run of signs, but someone's updated this and it is $166,000 worth of Minecraft signs. The most expensive signs in the game, if you will. I mean, look at these. These are insane. Uh, but yes, massive thank you to you all. Uh, there's no way I can even show this many in fact, you know what, I wonder if I should do a video for my second channel, which just showcases me going up and down all of these signs. Would you guys be interested in that? If you donated, maybe, maybe you would be. It could be a cool way of uh, showing you guys off. But, uh, you know, let me know in the comments. But yes, quick, massive, not very quick, but definitely a massive thank you to everybody that was able to help support us. We raised, I think right now the total is uh, for us only $845,000, which is ridiculous. The event itself raised, I think, just over 1 million, which is an insane amount, isn't it, Cal? See? Absolutely insane. Yeah, he had to back up again. He was like, oh, that was too insane for me. But yes, oh, I wanted to start off the episode here because what an amazing event, amazing charity. Now, as I'm flying back, I did really want to say that we did keep it completely secret that we were going to be there, mostly because we didn't want it to be a hermit con. Of course, we were aiming for it to be a fundraiser only. We didn't want to be spending any time not fundraising and meeting you guys, so it did have to be like that. Plus, we wanted it to be a surprise, which, of course, it was. I don't think anyone, I don't think I saw even a little inkling that you guys even knew that we were there. It was kind of very cool. It was, it was very, very cool indeed. It's good to be back on the server, Matt, but man, I did enjoy hanging out with some of these people. I'm doing this as if these people were even there. Isco was, and I Pearl was over there. Who's even on right now? Impulse was there, Jen was there. Ah, oh, it was very, very cool indeed. But yes, um, if you want to see that stuff, it's on my second channel. I have the streams that uh, I did on my channel over there, if you're interested. There were some fun, funny bits, especially with Tango and uh, playing guests to build, which is a which is a fun time. Well, now that I'm back in the UK, uh, it's time to head over to the shopping district to see what is new. And well, uh, I came across a certain uh, pawn shop and well, yeah, that's such a money maker. That's going to make so many diamonds. Where Joel is it? Where is it? And is an idiot. That's a good one for me to buy as well. That's that's a good one. Oh Pulse, my any... goodness. Oh my goodness. The cream rises oh god, to the hi. top. Oh my god, hi. Oh my god, hi. That how do oh everybody god, else's hi. sounds oh like god, a horn? Hi. False. Hi. That one just sounds like you. Oh my god, hi. 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 How are you doing that? Which one is real? Oh my god, hi. Oh my god, oh my god, hi. What? What? Oh my god, Oh my god, hi. That's the wrong one. Good. Have we died and gone to hell? Yeah, yes. <laughs> yes, we have. I'm buying... Is it weird that I'm buying my own voice? But you're buying yours? Yes. I'm unjustifiably in a position I'd rather not be in, but the cream rises <laughs> to the top. Okay. What's wrong with Cub? Everything. Oh, look at that beauty. I'm talking about myself, of course. Oh my god, Keep hi. slapping, mate. Keep oh slapping. Oh my god, hi. <laughs> Stop. Sorry. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> this is the only one I'm buying. Is... This is it. I'm, I'm sorted. That is freaky. I need more. I need more. Oh Smoking like a true king. Oh my god, bye! Oh my god, bye, oh my god, bye Jim! Bye. Bye. <laughs> Goodbye. I can't tell what's real. Well, can you tell I had fun here? <laughs> Thanks to whoever made this. I think it's Cup. Is it Cup Band? I think it's Cup Band who made this. 
pretty crazy. He's already got uh, a load of diamonds. Like, look at this. He's going to be instantly at the very, very top of the trophy thing for sure. Is someone over there? There's a pearl over there. I can see her. I need to make a deal with pearl. I think with the dice, maybe temporarily. I'm not sure. I do want to get the cactus up and running, but there are still going to be a few colors that are a bit delayed. But anyway, if that's the only time you think I've used the horn since I've been back, uh, you'd be wrong. He was the second with my neighbor, Cleo. Right, well, Cleo is now on my neighbor, of course. And well, it'd be rude not to, wouldn't it? It would be rude not to uh, go greet them. So uh, I believe Cleo is right there. <laughs> exactly where I was looking. So let's go say hello, shall we? So let's see how this goes. Oh my God, hi. Oh my God, hi. Hi. Oh my God, hi. Oh my god, hi. <laughs> hi! Hang on, hang on, hang on. I don't think oh I have god, a hi. hi. Oh my I god, I don't have hi. a hi! Well, you have to get one now, Cleo! Well, I don't we have We have to communicate one, via horns! I'm eating a curly whirly right now, but it's nice to see a zoomer. That's all I've got. Oh, well, that's made me want a curly whirly now. Well, you know, we always want a curly whirly. Oh, no! Always... You made me hungry. Uh... I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, how about this one? Kidnapping involved, of course. Yes, yes. You're never leaving now, Foss. Mm. Oh my god, bye! Oh my god, bye! Oh my god, bye. <laughs> <laughs> I need to buy one. I need to, I'm getting cub. I'm getting cub to make the buy one. I need it. I, I've got this one. I've got... Oh no, no, not Joe. <laughs> that's mine. <laughs> that, that's a good one. Then I've got this Dang last it, one. Stop it, Scar! Somebody kill him now! Well, that's very appropriate. Scar's around. That's yeah, appropriate I mean, for anything and everything. <laughs> no one's good. <laughs> yeah, so those are my horns, but I don't have a high or a by horn. Yeah. And I'm sad now. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, I'll have to I'll have to find one. I think there's another one that's mine, but I, I didn't I didn't find it before. So I'll have to go have another look. I think there are a few I, th I think there are a few that have got you in it. I think there's only two with me. There's a few. So I'm good. <laughs> oh, don't say that, Cleo. I thought there was only two. I I think oh, I'm no. definitely sure I saw at least another two in there. But, you know, there are other people may have bought them. Oh, no. Anyway, I thought I'd come say uh, hello and, and, and also have a look hello. at this. This Thank is great. You. I love this. Yeah, I, I, I made it bigger today. I took off the top and then I extended it as well. So. Yeah, well, I didn't. I couldn't see the little... Is that a little bridge? I'm going to go on the look. It's a little bridge. Little bridge. There's a little bridge up there. Oh, it's cute. Oh, it's so cute. Yeah. Oh, it's this not is going cool. anywhere at the moment. But, no, but uh, I like yeah, this. Little, little, wizard, little wizard tower. A little, uh, wi a little it... wizard tower, Cleo says. Look at it. It's huge. I mean, if, oh, you judge a wizard by the size of his tower. I've been reliably informed. Well, then then it's very large. It, it is very large. I also need to figure out how to decorate this so it's not just a column. Oh, oh, you so got it, Cleo. Your decoration stuff. over there is amazing. So you, you got, you got it. You got it. Thank you. You can overlook the whole neighborhood and make sure everyone's behaving themselves. Why would I do that? I don't. Uh, I don't know. I'm not Lauren. I'm not Lauren. Most people would do that. I'm, 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 I'm mostly here to use this as like troublemakers, you know, and to join in. You're overlooking, make sure everyone's misbehaving themselves. Yes, that is much yeah. more my speed. <laughs> yeah. This is cool though. I feel like you need like a jumping pad so you can like jump into like something. Well, now that you've said that, that you need to jump through magic into. Oh, that would actually huh? play into my. Thank you, false. That, so yeah, that magic, would right? Magic. Into... Magic. I'm not cool. Yeah. Uh, sorry, my brain is just sort of like there is going to be things underground, mm. and like if you jump through like a magic portal, you get to the oh, things yes. underground. Yes. So that's. Well done, Fools. Let me know when Gold it's star. there, and I'll come over to give it a go, okay? I'm gonna, I, will, I will test yes. it for you. I, I will probably say it's done before it's finished, so you just fall and die. This is not demise, Cleo. Okay, you, can... <laughs> you don't have to, okay? You don't have to. <laughs> I don't have to, but, but you it will. would be funny. You will. I, I might. I might. Well, I might. You can also let me know when you're going to do that to someone else, and I will be there. Goat horns. There's so many in here. I'm going to be looking at these on stream sometime. But uh, these are the two that are mine. Uh, this one, in fact, this one actually works great for pearls. So in fact, you know what? <laughs> I wasn't going to do a third horn segment during this video, but you know what? Oh. Um, she had a fireworks shop. You know what? Let's see. Let's see. I think she's streaming right now. But let's, let's see. 
my brain's not working okay jet lag is hitting me hard okay don't don't complain it's a tough video to record where's bell gone though see look i've even lost her or maybe just watch her stream that might be a good idea too probably <laughs> watching the stream was the best idea here we go gotta sneak up because she's inside here i wanted to just see me before i use it you know so she gets the context <laughs> if we don't move she won't kill us I mean, I'm ready to with the crimes that have been committed in here, false. <laughs> I know you played a horn there, though. <laughs> I don't know what you mean. No, I don't know what you mean. I have no, no clue. No, no idea. No clue. No. Yeah, everything's fine. It's very yeah, normal. Yeah, it's all fine. Yeah. Very normal. Uh huh. You're not part. You're not part of the wood collective, are you? No, because I need sand myself for concrete. Can we talk about how much of a crime this is? Yeah, yeah. Let's be crime stoppers. We're stop stopping the crime. <laughs> what crime's Can we happening? Your floor for them? These floor colours? <laughs> yeah, these are a crime. Together? Two pinks? No. Don't be doing that. <laughs> no, not that. It's not the fact that it's opposite. Well, you're, you're looking at the floor. I don't know what's got. What Look, do you mean? But the cherry tree is on this side, but they're selling mangrove on this side. Oh, no, that is a crime. They've got it, they've got it normal everywhere else. It's a crime against interior design. It is. It is a crime against interior. Are you. Are you rhyming right now? Am I? Is this a rhyme? Are you are you doing a bunch of rhyme sentences? If I am, it's it's a. Uh, uh, I was a poet and I'm a poet and I wasn't aware. That's the quote, right? Yes. No, I have <laughs> no idea. You're rapping. I'm rapping. Yeah, I do <laughs> rap. Rapping. Well, if you think you can stop the symmetry, pearl, you know. Uh huh. I can rap. <laughs> That's false. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, sorry, I, I didn't mean to interrupt. <laughs> Oh no, the interrupt away, that's completely fine. I was just rambling about how this is illegal. <laughs> it is illegal. We'll have to start an interior design um, police force. I think so. And it's not decorated either. What the heck's up with this? Huh? Oh, thank you. Goodbye, false. <laughs> if we don't move, she won't kill us. Oh no, she's going to kill me. Oh, she's not. Okay, okay. <laughs> Oh, I thought she was going to come and uh, hit me on the head with the sword then. Oh god, the jet lag brain is not working. <laughs> I'll say that as if Pearl has not got the worst jet lag probably ever, being an, an Aussie and all that. Right, well, this organization I am doing this season is costing me quite a lot at the moment because uh, I'm going to need a lot of shulker boxes, and so I'm buying a few more because I am making one of these for each die. Uh, because, of course, I'm going to be collecting dies for my concrete shop. And speaking of that, now that I have an empty inventory of diamonds... Let's go and uh, check on our the, the selling over here. Now, I haven't stocked this since I went away, so I'm assuming there are going to be some diamonds in here. There are two stacks of black been taken, four stacks of grey. Nice. Okay, I know that those ones are going to be popular, and they are some of the harder ones to stock. Although, white. Look at this. Look how much white concrete. Who who needs white concrete? I've got I've got you covered. I've got you covered. Um, and do we do we did we did we sell any more? One one stack of that. Oh, a bunch of yellow. Nice. Okay, good. That, that's a nice, easy color to stock. I'm going to be doing a lot of this on stream. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We did some lime as well. No, that's green. Green. Nice. I am going to be getting my cactus farm set up pretty soon, so I will be able to probably get that on stock pretty soon too. And then did I get any pink? No, but I do have pink dye on me. So what's that? 51 diamonds. I'm going to add that to my total at my base, and uh, then I need to get in contact with Azuma at some point to, uh, to, 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 to get another trophy. You, oh, you know what? I might get on this. I might get on this. Wait, wait, wait. There's, there's, there's even a competition thing going on. Oh, I'm very, very close to this one, which is very nice. In fact, let me tally this up and I will get back to you and see where we're at. Right, well, my book is, I believe, this one. If I have got that correct earnings, here we go. So I need to add 51 to this one, which would make that 741. However, because it's so close to the 750, I probably should have checked the Glow Lichen shop, so... I'm going to do that. In fact, I'm going to take the book with me too. And, well, weirdly enough, it's exactly nine diamonds, which takes us to exactly, exactly on the dot, 750. So what I'm going to do now is put the date, which currently is the April, April 15th, uh, 2024. And uh, I'm going to go borrow this little tick here and uh, add that. Um, and there you go. We're now onto the 1,000 diamonds one. That's our next goal. And so let me add this to 750. And then also put the date just so, just so I remember when it was I actually updated this so that I don't do it too often. Because, of course, it's very unlikely that I'm going to be 
probably uh, d d d getting too many diamonds. So it costs one diamond block. So that means I will need to get one, two, three diamond blocks. Three diamond blocks! I've just, uh, I've just got my earnings and I'm spending them again. Yes, I know, by the way, this is this is Azuma's way of getting diamonds, which is very smart. But I do want a trophy. And also, you know what? We need, we need a bit of competition going on here. So I might, I might as well join in. So in fact, right now, I'd be second place. So you know what? I'm pretty happy with that. I'm pretty happy with that. So I'm just uh, getting some diamonds together for the, the, this and well, that leaves me with 47 total. <laughs> oh, that's so sad. Especially if I've just got the profit from the shop and so I don't have anywhere else that diamonds may be. I guess I've got some on the way from, from rivers and such, uh, which we'll get to a little bit later because we need to meet up with Stress to discuss something, I think, with rivers. But for now, I need to work out how the post office works. So uh, you know what? Let's head over there and buy some stamps. Uh, five diamonds in there for a bundle. Boom. I'm assuming that's how I do it. <laughs> and now I have a bundle of stamps, which is two for Azuma. You know what? That is good. We'll make that work. And yeah, I'll just send it all over in the one uh, with the one stamp. And that way I just am ready to send most mail. Okay, step two is working out how to use this. Now I have this, which was one of the gifts I had before. Now I've got books I can write in, so I'm going to write a little something for Azuma. So let me sign this book. Trophies. Smiley face. Sign and close. Beautiful. Okay, so we've got Azuma stamp there. We're going to put the other one in the bundle. And the bundle is just going to sit in here. There you go, stamp bundle. As well as the stuff I got previously. And <laughs> this is going to go well, isn't it? Isn't it? Right. What do I do? I think I put the stamp in here. Oh, wait a second. I've got I've got incoming mail first. You've got mail. There you go. Thank you for letting me know. I did get mail. Um, I wasn't nearby to, to hear it, but... Oh, this is Cleo. Okay, long story short, Cleo is able to basically do some mail on sound for people. I'm not going to read the book. You've already seen it already, I'm sure. But basically, long story short, let's make sure I actually send the correct one. This is the one I want. Three diamond blocks and that. So I'm going to chuck this in. Uh, one stamp in here. Okay, good. And then the thing. Stamps in there, Zuma. Things in there. I like press the button. Maybe. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone. It, it did a thing. It vanished. It did a vanish. I'm really hoping that went the right place. Please tell me it went the right place. Did you go the right place? Well, having popped over to Azuma's and found it very, very difficult to find his post box, I did in fact find it and confirmed that it did in fact make it. So yay, my post box works. That's the first time using it. So I did want to double check just uh, before I start sending things, you know, because I'm going to need to send things, I'm sure. So speaking of things being in the right place or the wrong place, uh, let's go chat with Stress, who we spoke to a little bit earlier on. There's a wild Stress. Wait, no, there's a wild Isco. Wait, what? <laughs> Is that Stress or Isco? Oh, it's Stress. Okay. Interesting. I guess I should go see what she's up to. She's, she's wandering around. She's doing some some stuff and things. Very odd. Although I'm not actually sure where she's going. I just... I swear I saw her. Get off my lawn! <laughs> Rude, false. I was coming over to see you. Oh, okay. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Um, I am coming with a suggestion. A suggestion? Yes. And hoping that you uh, don't get offended. I mean, you looking downwards makes me worried, to, uh, to be honest with you. <laughs> this is my, this Maybe is don't my do shame. that when you say that. It's, Maybe. <laughs> it's, it's my shame face. Oh. My shame. Poor stress. Um, <laughs> all right, I've been, I've been looking at me stuff. Okay, come over here. You've been so looking I at know your that stuff. you've okay. done... I know that you've done these beautiful rivers and they're gorgeous looking. Thank you. Um, but it's a bit of a funky bend on my <gasps> side. <laughs> a funky bend? A funky bend. <laughs> we must fix that. We can't have funky bends happening. <laughs> what do you mean? Um, well, I was kind of looking at what I could do at the front of my base and I don't think there's enough space outside of my base. At the you front. are a little bit squished. I am a little bit squished. So you did do that so, to yourself. <laughs> <laughs> the blame is on you, well, stress. I, built, I built right up against the water that's behind it, so I've got nothing behind it. Unfortunately, that's true. 
But um, I did do a little bit of planning with uh, these blocks here and mm -hmm. was hoping that because you're kind of the river lady, that maybe we could scooch it over a little bit and have it at a better wonky bend. Oh, I mean, that might be pricey stress. But, uh... <laughs> oh, wait, I have to pay for this. I mean, well, I've not had to move a river before, you know. You're usually just adding <laughs> new ones and removing old ones, you know. But... Seems fair, seems fair. But you know what? I can, I can do that. I can do that. Yeah? Are you sure? I was kind yeah. of worried that I was asking a bit too much. No, that's fine. And then we move this path over as well, right? So you get all the space. Oh. All the space for activities, you know? Yeah, you yeah, can yeah. Get to, you get to run around. <laughs> Build a little uh, dancing stage and we can have a little yeah. movie out the front. A little playground, <laughs> you know. A little, You know, you've got lots of options. Lots of options. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you're not offended. Okay, that's perfect. I mean, yeah, I'm offended. But, uh, but no, I'm okay, I'm okay with that. <laughs> Susan needs all oh, the space, yeah. okay? I'm thinking about Susan here. Yeah. She wants some space in front, you know. What? Yeah, I've already de-hatted her, did you see? Yeah, no, I, I, I borrowed it back. It's fine. You borrowed it back? Yeah. <laughs> People were upset that I removed the hat. They it's said she right. looked better with it. <laughs> no one worry about the hat. The hat will uh, live again, I'm sure. I'm sure. Susan, well, maybe cool. not. But, you know. <laughs> no, I think she's long gone. Yes, poor, poor Susan. But yes, uh, I've been starting a little bit of work here. Now, my plan is to do this on mostly live stream, removing this path and obviously moving the river itself as well. Uh, but my internet has been literally poop. This whole week, I am back. My internet is unable to stream right now, which sucks massively because I'm so excited to stream. You don't even know it. Uh, so please go follow me on Twitch if you uh, are interested. But anyway, there's some spoilers over there, so we'll be careful of that. But yes, this will be done, obviously, just, just whenever I get around to it at this moment. But seeing as like it's getting dark, I think we should go underground. And you know what I've been thinking about quite a lot since I've been away? Uh, I've been thinking quite a lot about uh, this concrete maker. And you know what? I did do a little bit of extending of some blocks. I added a ceiling, by the way, as well. Look at this. Let's put gamma on real quick so you can actually see it. Because it is very dark in here. But look, we've got a ceiling. We've got a little bit of detail going on. I've got a little bit of a... Uh, I'm going to put some flowers up here. In fact, I'm thinking of putting... I've been wandering around here recently, and I'm thinking of putting a barrel there and the two tall flowers either side, and having it as a little bit of a manual, like, dye thing, if I'm a little bit short of dye or something. It could be kind of cool, right? It could be kind of cool. But seeing as though I've got this one farm here now, which was a complicated one to build, especially last minute before my trip, I'm thinking of building one here too. So you know what I'm thinking about doing? Digging. Something I do pretty well. So let me uh, start digging out a area for a cactus farm. Let's get it. So I just realized I didn't actually show you the progress I made on underneath the concrete farm. I actually just did this off camera completely. Um, this is the uh, the concrete farm, as I, you can see. That's the farm up there. This is the water drop. And then I didn't do the downstairs area. This area here that just had the chest. And it was just basically a stone room. And I've just done something basic down here, a little bit like dungeon-like, a little bit kind of, I want to feel like broken, as if like, you know, people have come along, they've not looked after it, and it's kind of broken a bit. Uh, and I quite like it, and I thought, you know what, let's chuck in a door here, so that I can do some sort of like, I don't know, behind the scenes, like, I can get to this farm, to then the cactus farm that's going to be in this hole that I, I just dug out. And yeah, we're going to go with that. So I'm thinking, I've just been looking at blocks of, to use here, and I'm thinking... I'm probably going to change these out, but I think I'm just going to go with these. Uh, they don't really go with anything specific, but it's going to be the, the actual farm itself. The design around it will probably uh, change, and I might even change out these blocks. But it's going to be quite an easy farm to build, as you guys know. You guys know how this works. There's a block, then there's water, then there's sand and cactus, and then the cactus has, like, stuff next to it, like fences and stuff, and then it drops, and then it all gets collected below. And so that's all that's going to go in here. So you know what? I didn't want to do another time lapse, but... This thing's so quick to make that, you know, you might as well blink in the, uh, see the whole thing built. It's going to be pretty basic, so let's get it done. So here we have it, the cactus farm. It is not quite finished, as you can see. I am, in fact, adding the cactus. Now, I'm going to have to check the uh, light level here, because I don't want any block other than maybe the sand to be spawnable, because the sand will be covered with the cactus. And I think that, even though it's not a full block, it's still not spawnable. That nothing's going to spawn next to a cactus, I'm pretty sure. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to show you from the very tippity top in just a second. I keep forgetting I've got Swift Sneak on. Weirdly enough, Swift Sneak 3 on my trousers are actually faster than me walking, 
which is very kind of off-putting, weirdly enough. I probably should have just bought the, the Sneak 2, which was a heck of a lot cheaper. I spent 50 diamonds on that, on that book. <laughs> You're welcome, Cleo. Uh, and also, by the way, if you're wondering what this is, this is actually, it was just up there on a piece of dirt. It was the uh, the flag for the map that just has false on it uh, so that the map in the area ooh, is uh, is accurate. And in fact, you know what? We've got exactly the right amount of cactus. Well, not, well, a little bit extra, but that's a good thing because I haven't even been on all that long and I have with just the bottom layer and a little bit of the second layer basically filled in the whole farm now as you can see we've got a bit of a design thing going on here now i've kept it very basic because i haven't actually decided how i want it to look yet but i'm thinking now that i've got it actually on here so this was the idea in my head i wanted the bottom one to be a full layer a full layer four squares and then it would go up by two so we've got this kind of like uh, i want to say helix is that the right word i'm not sure but we've got this sort of that sort of design which i think from above looks kind of cool and I do like that I can sort of almost like glide down into the farm uh, from here. I can sort of go like this. And I mean, I know that the exit that I built is currently over here, but it doesn't have to be. <laughs> this is just uh, the way I'm going to connect it up. And uh, I haven't done anything down here at all just yet. There's a torch. Um, but yeah, these this cactus right here is actually... Oh my goodness, I've still got uh, almost two sacks. That's all that's come from this farm so far. Wow, okay. I'm actually really impressed. And you know what's really good about this farm? is that I've been thinking about doing something down here that is sort of a duo thing. Now, I might, you know, I'm going to have to count to see, see how equal these chests are in terms of drops. I think they should be fairly equal. There might be one that's probably a little bit lower. But picture this. Half of it, maybe even like half of it split down the middle. These two potentially are for smelting. So maybe I put a uh, smelter down here. And I think you can smelt with cactus. If I'm wrong, then I'm wrong. doesn't matter. Uh, I can always put a kelp farm in or something else instead. But for a smelter... And then this side, it would be for dye, so I, I could I could hook up some crafters, potentially. And also, I could, in a weird way, like, I don't want to make, make everything automatic, because it's going to overcomplicate things for me personally, especially with the redstone. But it'd be really cool if it was all gathered in, like, a dye uh, thing, so I can come and grab it when I need to, because this this here is the, uh, uh, obviously, the, the concrete farm, uh, which I have been running, and I think, have I grabbed the orange from in here? I think I have. A lot of people said about maybe organizing this so that the colors go into certain chests, but I I mean, I could do. I don't know how easy that would be it to fit into this particular design. I guess I could probably just put a filter on these, actually, right? One item there and then 42 or whatever the number is of other random blocks. Maybe I'll give it a go, but it isn't necessary. I guess the 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16. You know, there is enough for every color. I mean, maybe that's an idea. We will see. But yeah, I've also got this. Oh, look, I've got a bat. I've also got this. I can come out here if I need to. Anyway, it's a drizzly day on the server, but IRL, it's actually really sunny. So I'm going to actually take some time outside because guess what? I haven't done that in a little while since the trip. So I'm going to take a little bit of a break. You guys do so too. Make sure you, you stay hydrated and grab some foods and uh, go see the sun and touch grass and all that good stuff. And I'll catch you all next time. See ya.